So it's Christmas. Uh, it's actually the evening of Christmas today. I got that COVID hair going strong. Whole nine yards of staying home lockdown. Just thought I'd reach out to everybody and uh, you know do a thank you video. This has been a crazy year. Everybody knows that 2020 has been weird. It's it's just gonna keep being weird. 2021 is not gonna change right out the door. Nothing's gonna change on January 1st. But you know, from from my small business to all y'all watching, I wanted to say thank you. It's been a very weird year, and because of the support of y'all watching, and especially the people over on Patreon, 2020's been okay. It's not great. You know, we've got a couple days, a week left in the year, and um, we've just barely eclipsed 2019 as far as, you know, financial success or whatnot, and that's you know that's that's been a really cool thing to to be able to say that in all this craziness we still managed to grow it's not going to be a lot it's not going to be a bunch but you know growth is growth and not backsliding is not backsliding and our, i i feel for the people out there that were you know god help you if you were in the tourist industry or the restaurant industry it's been it's been nuts i, I do a lot of work for restaurants you guys know that you've been around you've seen that and I've, I've watched my customers hurt and suffer for it. And, you know, we've, we've done what we can to help them out. We've done jobs for a lot less. Sometimes, you know, half an order of magnitude less than we would have done in the past. But it's, it's what it is. You, you take care of the people around you. And, uh, yeah, it's been, a, it's been a really good year. I know we've been quiet on videos. You know, I've had some personal things in my life that we've dealt with and um, it's, it's just what is what it is. You know, YouTube is a side gig for me. Uh, my business is my business and that's how I make my money. That's how I make sure Tommy gets paid. That's how I make sure the other people that help out get paid. But on that note, I do really want to say um, the, the people that bought, I can't do that. Sun's on the wrong side of me. The, uh, the people that bought Weld It Yourself kits, God, I appreciate y'all. Um, the Weld It Yourself kits thing started out as just a little side gig, a way to use up some of my scrap metal, and it's become something bigger than that. You know, it's not, it's not our business, it's not our main thing, but it sure helps. And with the holiday rush, it's, yeah, I've been, I, I don't really know what to say. I, I've been happy, surprised, and, um appreciative the the rush this year wasn't what it was last year but it was still good and um what i thought was gonna sell was a hundred percent wrong the things we made inventory of are still sitting on the shelves and and that's fine if you want one of those bassinet fire pits knock yourself out they're they're on sale um but what it meant was you know, Tommy got a paycheck every week. Tommy has not missed a paycheck this whole year. And that's been, uh, I'm, I'm proud of that. It's, it's, it's something that meant something to me. You know, I've, uh, when, when you're a business owner, it, it sounds super cool and super fun and all that. And you get to determine your own hours and whatnot. But the thing that nobody talks about is that you get paid last. And what it's meant for us is, I have, I think I've taken about $5,000 worth of pay out of the company this year, the whole year. Uh, now, fortunately, you know, my wife works, has a great job, so that's worked. I've had savings. I don't really spend a lot of money, even, you know, before this relationship, all that. I, I could live pretty comfortably for 20 or 25 grand a year. I don't have kids. I'm not a concert guy. I don't really go do stuff and when I travel mostly it's for work so it's a write-off and the company pays for it but what it's meant is that you know the, the people that counted on me could keep counting on me and and that's that feels good that's you know it's it's good to it's good to feel like you're reliable even when being reliable is out of your control to some respect um, this Christmas rush was interesting too. We had, you know, a couple days there where we were working just, I was pulling like 16, 18 hour days to get everything made and shipped out. And uh, 
aside from if the post office messed something up, everybody got their orders before Christmas, which feels good. But one of the things that meant for me was that a couple of my friends, people that, you know, I can count on to, to work well, not be uh, problematic, not show up drunk or late or something, were able, I was able to put some money in their hands and um, let them have a little bit better Christmas than they might have. And, and that's not because of me, it was because of the people making orders. So thank you. You know, 42 Fab's been a, an adventure for me. I went to school for civil engineering. I, I always thought I was gonna build roads and bridges. I was really good at it. And in six months at a desk, I put on like 50 pounds. I wasn't happy. I got really good at drinking. You know, it, it wasn't something that was good for me. And you know, it was, a, it was a hard realization to come to that the thing that you thought you were gonna do was not what you were gonna do. But it was the right thing to do. And that was almost six years ago. And this business has been a lucrative or, or at least comfortable full-time endeavor for the past four or five years so it, it took a while to get to where we are but it's been good and it's not it's not because of some magic skill I have it's not because of something extra I've got going on it's because you know my customers locally are reliable customers that that count on me to deliver and pay accordingly and then the people out there buying kits are are wonderful it's been it's been great um i don't want to make this a pitch but i have not turned off our black friday coupon it's still 10 percent off anything in the store so if you're interested grab yourself one we always appreciate that um yeah 2020 has been crazy guys um like i said i know i've been quiet we're coming roaring back. I've got a bunch of videos lined up and uh, I just wanted to, you know, have five or six lined up before I started posting so that I'm not putting a video up and then disappearing for another month and yada, yada, yada. So yeah, we're coming back 2021, plan on rocking it. Hope you guys will come along with me. If you're building your business, God, I'd love to have you along. Uh, you know, Patreon's always, if, if you feel like you get some information on the bid breakdowns and whatnot, check it out if you don't like it send me a message before your first you know before the end of the month that you join i'll refund all of it to you i'm not about you know trying to squeeze blood from a stone if you like it and it's helpful to you knock yourselves out the people on the screen have been great i i, I don't normally get too big into numbers on the the main channel that's what we do on patreon but you know the patrons constituted a little bit over six percent of the income of my business this year and you know six percent isn't a huge jump but what it means is that for every 16 dollars that i made one of them came from the patrons that's that's not nothing that's two days out of a month worth of my income something like that you know it's it's significant and i appreciate the guys over there i'm run, running them all on the screen here and you know a dollar to the max level Thank y'all. Um, yeah, guys. Uh, what, I, what I'm planning on doing here is one of the first videos coming back full force is a, uh, a year in review. You know, what I learned, how we pivoted, all of that. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down in the comments. I'll try and hit as many of them as I can in the, uh, in the video. It's freaking cold here. I'm wearing my insulated shirt and it's still cold. Yeah. Guys, I appreciate it. YouTube was, I didn't know what the hell I was doing getting into it. And it's been, it's been a, a really cool adventure. You know, the people I've met, the, uh, the, the stories I've shared with people, the, the places I've been since, since joining YouTube, I've driven my Jeep to 47 states. That's cool as hell. And that wouldn't have happened if it weren't for the community around here. And even if you're not somebody that I ever came and visited or, or reached out or anything like that, just being part of the community helps there. So I appreciate it. You know, this is, uh, this, this is me trying to figure out how to say thank y'all just for watching, you know, one watch, one like, one subscribe. Don't forget to get subscribed. 
it helps. It, it really does. It, it says that what we're doing is something that's valuable and, you know, that means something. And I appreciate it. Here's to a 2021 we can all be proud of.